Hello friends, in this video I will tell about water. Water is also called life and this is the reality because without water on earth life of trees, plants, animal and human is not possible. Human beings can live for many days without food. But it is impossible to survive even two to four days without water. Without water, we can not even imagine the existence of trees, plants and animals. On two thirds of the earth, water exists in the form of ocean. But the irony is that water is of two types saline or salty water and sweet water and sweet or fresh water the water of ocean is saline but humans trees plants and animals need fresh water only three percent of water available on earth is potable Thus, we can understand the importance of water. Despite water being so important, we have not used this precious gift of nature properly in the whole world. Today, in many big cities of the world and all over India, lack of water for drinking has become a major problem. Nobody had even imagined hundred years ago that one would have to buy drinking water. People from many cities of the world like Johannesburg in South Africa and many big cities of India like Delhi, Chennai, Bangalore, Mumbai are facing water scarcity. Water is also a big problem in villages in states like Maharashtra, Rajasthan, Karnataka. In India, farmers are not able to get water for their fields. Children and women have to travel for hours for drinking water. People have to wait for a tanker for water. There are many reasons for the lack of water. One of the most important causes is the increasing population and urbanization. The water inside the ground is being trapped randomly due to which the water level inside the ground has gone very low. In many places now, we are not able to extract water from inside the earth. There is rain all over India, but we are not able to collect rain water and proper management of rivers is not being done. We have polluted the water of the rivers badly by dirty water and waste flowing from the drains of the cities in the rivers due to which it is no longer potable. If we are still not aware, then we will be responsible for putting human life on this earth in peril in the future. We can all avoid water crisis by making a small change in our lives and being aware. The most important is the rainwater harvesting. Rainwater can be collected by making small ponds in water in villages and cities. We can collect the raining water in every house using the technique of water harvesting. We can save a lot of water from being wasted if we are aware of it in our everyday life such as for bathing, washing the car 
or for washing pets use bucket instead of shower or water pipes keep preparing water pipes or taps so that water is not wasted we can use the kitchen or bathroom water in the kitchen garden we should use small glass for drinking water our government can manage water by connecting rivers to stay healthy we must drink clean water drinking contaminated water causes disease like jaundice dysentery diarrhea to be healthy a person should drink at least 2 liter of water per day apart from drinking there are many uses of water transport by ship in sea water and rivers sea water also produces salt water is needed for agri agricultural irrigation electricity is made from water by constructing dams on rivers water has been considered the best solvent in the chemical science because most substances easily dissolve in water water is a chemical substance consisting of hydrogen and oxygen it is a colorless tasteless and transparent liquid water is the only substance on earth that we can see in all three forms of matter in our normal life at 0 centigrade temperature water changes from its liquid form to solid form ice and above 100 centigrade temperature water starts boiling and changes from its liquid form to gas form vapor the density of water is the highest in the liquid form that is why the snowflakes are seen floating on the water the density of water is maximum at 4 centigrade temperature the sea water rises in the atmosphere by evaporation and condenses into a cloud the cloud then rains on the earth again and the water flows back to the sea through the rivers thus a water cycle is formed and this way water on earth remains almost unchanged so if water is there there is future use water but please don't waste water water thanks and have a nice day